Care workers brace for more COVID-19 cases in our area. Some community members in Winnebago want to make sure they have everything they need. 13 News reporter Lauren Baker shows us how they are using their hands and hearts to create some much needed supplies. It's a story you'll see only on 13 News. Stitch by stitch. Neighbors like Heidi Miller are spending their downtime making crucial items for those working around the clock. It makes me feel really good to be able to help somebody. She and others are creating face masks for healthcare workers for places like Heartland Hospice. That we just want them to be protected and safe. Being able to help the people on the front line really feels good. Beth Cody says she saw an opportunity for local crafters to use their skills to help healthcare workers in the area. A hand sewn protective gear is not the best thing in the world, but it's something and it's better than nothing. She took to Facebook to announce her project and dozens joined in. The only way we're gonna get through this pandemic is for the community to come together. We have the blood of our grandmothers who did victory gardens who knitted socks and who worked in factories to to help a war effort. And in my mind, this is something similar. After the final stitch, they'll be taken to the facility and sterilized. Just like a final piece isn't finished with just one stitch. Yes, I want to help out. The people on the front line are already exhausted from caring for people. They should have the equipment, the materials they need. These many hands use many stitches to hold our community together. For your 13 Weather Authority, Lauren Baker, 13 News. If you would like to donate materials to make a mask or would like to sew one yourself, to figure out how to do so, just head to our website, wrex.com.